Good morning guys, welcome to another Daily Juice. We've come to Dean and Deluca today for a quick espresso and we're going to hop in the grab and explore a part of Manila we've never seen. Wow, look at this. We need to, no, we need to be good. None of the, oh. No, none of this today. Hello. I think I want a cortado. Why don't you get a macchiato? Do they have that? All right, can I have uh, one cortado, please? And a double espresso, please. Cortado this morning. We don't normally come to Dean and DeLuca for coffee, but this looks and tastes pretty good. Picking up a quick breakfast now uh, before we hit the road off to the old walled city of Manila today, which we haven't been to. The building we're staying, Eaton Towers, has this thing, which is like a healthy power breakfast. <gasps> oh no, they haven't got it. We were going to have a healthy power breakfast smoothie, but I think they've run out same stuff but with a different fruit so is it just apple and orange yeah okay would that be weird um it's normally banana i trust you nice t-shirt today thank you coming very soon guys may you already be there by the time you watch this oh but i don't want to say that just in case we it's not. cannot wait we need two versions to edit the merch is out <laughs> yeah. the merch isn't out yet it's coming very soon <laughs> um, so we're just getting a grab now um loads of you guys have suggested that we um, explore a little bit more of the actual center of, I'd say the center, when you search Manila, it's kind of where the words Manila are on Google Maps. Manila's huge, it's Metro Manila, um, which is where we normally say you've got Makati, BGC, which is kind of where we pop between, and you've got where the um, Malls of Asia area is, which is kind of a completely different direction. You've got the airport area, you've got Manila so Bay. many different places in Manila Bay. Like, I feel like we've seen quite a few different places, but never actually gone to where we're going today, which is, the, like old town I think it's like the walled part intramuros but is this is in Metro Manila still maybe I'm a bit wrong with this comment below what Metro Manila actually means if it is most of this part or not um, and also somewhere called Rizzle Park um, loads of your DMs have said guys get yourselves here when we said we're in Quezon City the other day you said please explore more of that area um, but also this place we're going to today so that's what the plan is um, I don't really know what to expect um, I, ri I literally have just know the words, the park and that it's walled and I don't know what's in it, what, uh, I assume you can just walk in, I don't know if you have to pay to get in or if it's where people live, I really have no expectations for this at all, um, but we're going to get in a grab now and go and explore. Ladies first. Hello. Just been dropped off at Rizzle Park, I'm going to walk and try not hit into any children today if you saw that vlog yesterday. That wasn't good, but we've already seen like horse and cart. Oh, yeah. This is huge. I didn't know it'd be so big. We're going to get inside, have a little explore around. Uh, look at that. Huge flag here. Oh my god. Wow. This, is, this so is so bright. huge. I had no idea it would be this big. It's so bright. <laughs> How is. Where do they have space for this? Yeah. All the traffic and roads and stuff. All right, cool. I'm excited Let's go to down have here. a little look around. We're just going to go over here now. There's some armed guards. I'm not going to get too close. And um, there's some uh, loads of statues here, and there's some plaques on them that explain sort of what they all mean and stuff. Like, ah, oh, we can't actually get into this bit. We on purpose didn't research this place so that we had no expectations to be sort of uh, to give you guys a genuine reaction of it. It is blazing hot today, guys. Blazing. And I'm wearing a black t-shirt. Blazing. <laughs> um, yeah. I'm wearing a black and white t-shirt, so like, this is hot, this is cool, this is hot, this is cool, this no, is hot. No, it's not, can you imagine? <laughs> <laughs> the whole park seems to be quite exposed to sun, and um, we've been trying to stay out of the sun a little bit um, these past few days, especially, uh, what is it? It's literally, yeah. it's half 11, it's nearly midday, can which is like facts? the hottest part of the day. Yeah, can sure. Can I do some facts? I love giving you facts. I love learning, I love facts. Rizal Park, also known as Luneta Park, or simply Luneta, is a historical urban park in the Philippines, formerly known as 
<clears throat> Ready? Yeah. Bagum Bayan, colonialism under the Spaniards. With the fountain, all the fountains are going around here, but they're not on that side. And there's oh, there's a guy in the water. Maybe he's fixing it. But there's loads of things going on in this lake to get all the fountains up. But I don't know if maybe maybe half of it's not working. You can see how hot it gets here. Cause look, that Philippine flag, the blue looks like a light purple colour because it's been in the sun for so long. Oh it's yeah, it. faded. <laughs> so I actually can't see how hot it is. It's also really, really quiet here today. It's the Monday after Easter Sunday. People go back to work today. I'm not sure in the UK. Or is it still a holiday. In the UK, this is still a uh, what's called a bank holiday where people are off work. Um, so there's no one at work today, but <laughs> we're having photos of us being taken. But um, <laughs> I think it's a video. We're not sure. It's nice and quiet here, which is so interesting because the drive here was so much traffic, oh, loads going manic. on, Proper super Manila, busy. How I think yeah, Manila. Manila is back to full traffic now. Yeah. Uh, it was cool to experience it with hardly any traffic during Holy Week, yeah. but um, it seems like everything's more or less back to normal now. All right, we're going to go and explore the walled city now, which I'm very excited about. I've only seen this online in photos, I never been seen here before. How First cool experience. Have you seen? Um, I think I watched someone else's did you, vlog. Did you look it up without telling me, George? <sighs> Might have done. How rude. Let's go. This is where everyone is getting some shade. Yeah. Very smart. I think we need that and I think we need some water or some Buko juice. I saw a sign for it, just Ooh, saying, yes, a bit please. of hydration. I'm taking a little walk now, uh, a little bit further down and I can actually see the first part of the wall here. And it looks like you can just walk in. I don't think you have to pay or anything to go in here. Here we are. We're just entering the walled city now. Wow, it's really like, very different. This tiny little uh, bridge has just completely changed what it looked like. Um, the buildings look totally different. Wow, there's the University of Manila there. It's a bit like vegan, isn't it? It's Spanish, I suppose. Yeah. Really cool. So different though. Look at these buildings there and there. Although one thing we have noticed is every, here we go, right on cue, every four seconds a tricycle driver comes to try and sell you a tour um, because I think it's very, uh, very big and they said it's like six to seven hours to around the whole thing and it's like 60 hectares or something. Um, but for us today, we just want to explore at our own pace and just see what we see and it's just kind of hot so we don't want to spend too long out in the sun today, uh, but more just kind of get a feel for the place. But already, I love it. It's so beautiful. It's cool. It's um, so nice. Uh, we actually haven't eaten breakfast today yet, so we're looking, hopefully we'll find a little bit of food. I'm not sure what's here in terms of restaurants and food options and things, but Hopefully we'll find something. I appreciate it. Thank you. So I've just come across a very, very um, interesting and historic and old building here. Honestly, I'm quite taken back at how traditional it seems. It's called Starbucks. Should we go inside? Starbucks. <laughs> oh yeah, wow, look at that. Don't worry guys, we're not getting breakfast in Starbucks. We're gonna try and find somewhere that's a little bit more traditional. Yeah, I had a quick look on Google and, oh, some friendly people here smiling at us. I had a quick look on Google and there's a place called Barber's Heritage, which is apparently quite an old traditional restaurant. Uh, it's got good ratings, so we're gonna, gonna hop in there. It's just down this road here. Here we are. Lucy's right, this is 100% reminding us of vegan when we visited vegan. It's got that similar kind of uh, old Spanishy kind of vibe with the buildings, tall ceilings, the wood. It feels quite historic. This place has a buffet, um, but we fear if we go for that option, we'll end up stuffing our faces and feeling sick. <laughs> uh, so we've decided to order off the a la carte menu because we've gone for a pasta dish each. Um, it's quite fun to get. Uh, George's got a mango shake, I've got fresh coconut. It's very traditional in here, it's great. And you also get some live music. These guys are singing and playing guitar, which is really nice. It just looks so old fashioned in here with like the wooden ceilings and the big chandeliers and stuff, and the huge tables with all the millions of different cutlery that you don't know what to do with. I mean, how many of these do I need to eat pasta with? <laughs> So, in being sat here, our friend Jesse, who showed us around about city, uh, has just told me that we're currently 177 feet away from the oldest church 
Not in Manila, not in Luzon, in the Philippines. How mad is that? There's so many churches across the whole of the Philippines and we're sat next to the oldest. That's crazy. We should go and look at it after this, yeah? Yeah. So we're now at San Augustine Church. Uh, it's massive and you can see like the bell tower just stuck. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There it is. Just up there. And the uh, clock and stuff. It's really beautiful. But it does look very old, doesn't it? With a huge like brickwork and I'm guessing it's been restored at some point. Because I don't know. I feel like if it's the oldest it wouldn't still be looking this yeah. well put point. together. Yeah. So driving through here, uh, walking through here, sorry, it does feel kind of touristy-ish. Um, but I don't know if people actually live here or not in the actual wall city. Um, I'm pretty sure there's like hotels and obviously like restaurants and stuff for people that want to come and visit, but I don't know. Do you think people live here? Hi! Hi! How are you? Hi! Hi. Hi. <laughs> just saying hello to us, it's A lot of people seem to know us here. <laughs> or not, maybe they're just very friendly. Maybe. So now we're at the cathedral. Whoa, it's massive. Big green roof. Wow. Um, is that the cathedral, right? Yeah. Has it got looks, a name? Looks like a cathedral. Does it have a name? Uh, Kathy. No. <laughs> the name of it, like the cathedral of, or the something it's cathedral. The cathedral of Manila. Oh. <laughs> I actually don't. I'm, I'm honestly not sure. Maybe there's a okay. sign outside. Okay. We'll have a look. Oh, that's quite impressive though, isn't it? Huge. Huge. Really wow. nice. nice. There's the um, cathedral in Chichester, which is a town kind of near where we live, called Chichester Cathedral, original. Um, and it's beautiful, isn't it? It's so cool here because it... I don't know why, because if I wasn't told and I was just placed here, I wouldn't know it was walled, but I feel like we're True. inside something. Do you have the same feeling? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a really odd feeling. I feel like we're inside a walled area, which we are. <laughs> no, but even if I didn't, I don't know why, because you can't see the walls True. from No, here. you're right, you're right. But um, really impressed by this place. I'm glad we took the time to come here today and explore, even though it's boiling hot. Um, we've actually got a, a meet up with some viewers later in BGC, so. If it's already, if you're watching this and it already has happened yesterday or something and you came, thanks so much. We're looking forward to seeing some of you there tonight. So we've got to get back to the hotel fresh and up because we're so, so hot and sweaty, so we can't. Yeah, we I can't don't want to hug anyone like this. Like this. <laughs> yeah, but overall impressions of this place, very cool, very different. Even in, I say it about the Philippines all the time, how varied it is with the cities, the beaches, the islands, the mountains. The other day at the Five Fingers thing, the different rock formations. So, so, so much variation in the Philippines, but it's the same even just within Manila. I've never seen anything like this in Manila. How many times can George say Manila in one sentence? I can try more if you want. <laughs> no, but what I'm trying to say is that even just, how long was that taxi ride? Like 20 minutes yeah, from, from BGC. Yeah. And then it looks like this, looks a bit like vegan and uh, crazy. So much history in this country. So much to explore, so much to see, so much to do. We love it, absolutely love it here. So we came back to the room, edited up the vlog. It's all done and ready to go now. This is our view, by the way. Ooh, it's very bright, hang on. Just here, and the bed's right next to it. So it's super nice waking up here in the mornings. But um, we're gonna get in a grab now and head over to BGC. We've got about three hours until our meet up. Uh, we're gonna meet Mike and Nelly, have a delicious salad at Souve, uh, which is one of our favorite restaurants here in Manila, and then head over to the high street uh, to meet some of you guys, hopefully as well, which is, so exciting, like uh, I think it was in Mike and Nelly's caption the other day, they put it really well. We love to communicate with you guys in the comments, on Instagram DMs, on Instagram posts, uh, on the community tab on here, on Facebook, everywhere. We love communicating with you guys, we love messaging, we love getting your recommendations or just chatting about stuff. Uh, we do it as often as we can uh, and try to reply to as much as we possibly can as well at all times. But uh, meeting you guys in person is always really, really special. Our last meet up. We gave a lot more notice than this one. We gave like three or four weeks notice and we were totally overwhelmed by how many people turned up as well. And it was such, such a special day. Uh, one I rem remember forever and ever and ever. Uh, but today's, we only announced it yesterday. So we're not, not expecting it to be anywhere near the size as last time. Um, but just quite a few of you guys have suggested that we do one in BGC uh, just while we're in Manila this time. 
so that's what we've done um so it'd be really nice to meet a handful of you um, just chat and hang out it's what we love doing the most for sure um but jordan has gone to get the laundry bless him it's so hot outside i said i'd finish off uh the vlog and he could do that and i'll meet him downstairs so let's get going to bgc not sure that my hair's good enough for this meet up this evening we're not sure how many people are going to be coming because we um said it we announced it very very late like a day ago so uh hopefully be there there'll be a few people there who we can chat to and hang out with max's restaurant have actually sorted us out in bgc the owner dm dusty is going to sort out some refreshments some uh drinks and some snacks and stuff like that lucy and i've just come in to soothe one of our favorite greek places and i'm going for this bad boy Okay, we're currently experiencing an earthquake and all the staff, everything's moving, everything's shaking. Still going. Oh, my heart's going really fast. People are just walking normally, but the cars are still driving. I wonder what it's like to be in a car. So we're just leaving Sunny's now. Mike and Millie are just going live on YouTube. Go check that out if you haven't already. It's them. Um, actually at the meetup. They're doing a live video, which is a really cool idea. Really uh, we should cool. do that sometime as well. Great idea. Let's wait for them. Oh, we should really. One wheel. Last one wheel. The last meetup we did, um, they were running late. They had to sort... No, oh yeah, we couldn't check into our hotel, so everything was going a bit wrong. It was all running late, um, and we had to go on our own for like 20 minutes without them. It was quite funny, um, but we we're all going to go together this time. And when I came outside a minute ago to watch up the vlog for yesterday, I met loads of you guys already that said it was really sweet. Someone called Kiss, who gave Nelly and I some earrings, which is really sweet uh, came over to us and said my um, baby's at home I need to get back to the earth like I can't make the meet up but I'm so happy I bumped into you outside um, but yeah really lovely to meet some of you already and hopefully we'll see a few more soon so Mike uh, just made a good point that a lot of people can't come we've had a few messages on Instagram saying I'm gonna be late or I can't make it because of the earthquake like it was gridlock traffic earlier taxis are really hard to get now Hi. <laughs> so just met Rob here and he drove for two hours to come and see us today and he's watching some December is crazy. Oh, really? Thank you so much. Oh, <laughs> Thank you. I love your videos. Thank you. This is crazy. We've come into Max's local and they've set up this room for us. Crazy. They're going to give nice. us some uh, snacks and drinks and stuff yeah, so yeah. we can get everyone to come up here and we can chill out and hang out and Let's get them. chat and stuff. We're just here with some people and loads of people yeah, here yeah. actually came yeah. to our last yeah. meetup, which oh. is crazy. <laughs> 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 oh, sorry, sorry, Wait sorry, sorry. Okay, bye. <laughs> oh. When was the last time? Well, well, high school. High school. No way. Yeah. These people haven't seen each other since high school and they just realised that they both watch our videos. Yeah. Yes. And they've met again for the first time in years. Here in BGC. Because of you guys. <laughs> Thank you so much. So Max is at the high street. I've picked us up tonight at Osprey Bright. Um, and they're going to get us some food, some drinks. Then we can just hang and chill out. Thank you. Chill out with everyone up here, which is really nice. Are you sitting down? That's what I just know what to do. So I'm here with Denise, who's travelled for four to five hours in the earthquake traffic to be here today. So much traffic. Crazy. I was kind of sad. Because I thought I'm not, I'm not gonna make it because of the traffic and all. And there was no ground anywhere because the MRE was shut down because of the earthquake. So I really came here just for this, for the juicy vlog and to make it happen. Like, it's crazy. I'm so happy. Five hours. Yeah. Unbelievable. Thank you. So I'm here, but I'm done. of everywhere we've ever been in the Philippines. This is insane. This is our whole trip documented. <laughs> Restaurants we've been to, the dates, where we were. I just said this is making me tired reading this. <laughs> yeah. I can't believe that we've done all this in such a short amount of time. True. It's so cool. So just that here chatting to everyone. And this is here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I spotted a little bit of a from under 
we're going to open up now and share with everyone. And they're also bringing some food up as well, which is really cool. It's so special. This happens every time George wears his t-shirt. Someone else wears his t-shirt. George. Oh, he's a bit busy. See? Look. Every time. Ta-da. <laughs> Today, sorry, you're taller than I think you are. There you go. <laughs> it's great to see so many people in real life who watch our videos. Yeah, and people we've been messaging on Instagram. Yeah, we're always messaging people. And then people say, Oh, I'm the one who sent you this message. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's you. Yeah. Uh, so uh, face to a name and then name to a face. Yeah. So, so cool. So, if you came down to the hotel, thanks so much. We really appreciate it. Mike's just getting a hello, hello lesson. Hello, hello, and hello, hello. Good? <laughs> Especially good because it had cheese on top. Oh, nice. George and Nelly are on catering. Yeah, what was that? Oh, nice. Wow, this looks great. They're giving us a bit of a feast here. We can all enjoy with our new friends. I'm available for Thank you. It is. Chicken! George! <laughs> Just leave it. <laughs> Sit down. <laughs> Anyone for pie? Yay! Hey. <laughs> okay, the pie was popular. We left with some meat. <laughs> One of my favorite spirit animals. Yours. Spirit animals. <laughs> These guys just had the idea that the next meter should be in a karaoke bar. Absolutely. Yeah. 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 Absolutely. Alright, that's going to be crazy. Yeah, true. Okay, comment below the best one in Manila, and we'll try and arrange it. Or maybe Max is going to set up there. Yeah, all that. Yeah, <laughs> true. <laughs> 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 oh, I'm linked in an arm. Thanks, guys. Thank you. More power. Guys. We just got back to our hotel room from the meetup and wow, we had the best time. It was so nice to hang out with so many of you guys and also so intimately that room they gave us was so cool. Those of you who joined us upstairs, um, we ended up just sitting, chatting and hanging out for a couple of hours. So it's so, so cool. We've been given some gifts, which Lucy so nice. It's gonna show you now. Amazing, amazing generosity again. Um, a few little bags here of stuff. I'll just show you what we've got here. Um, so, someone called Kiss who came up to us before the meetup got uh, me and Nelly some earrings, which are beautiful and they're uniquely Filipino. They're made here as well, which is super nice. And this little fridge magnet, which is cute. Oh, yes. Pilly nuts. <gasps> Delicious. Oh, I haven't had pilly nuts since we were with Jun. These are so good, how nice. Dearest, oh wow, oh, wow. look at this handwriting. That's nice, awesome. that's that? amazing. Dearest George and Alicia, I read in a book somewhere that oftentimes it takes the eye of a stranger to make nature's notice of beauty in the everyday. You have done exactly this to the Filipinos when you came to visit and when you put the spotlight on our country. You made us proud of the things we neglected for all that you've done, thank you. From Conrad, that's so oh, sweet. That's amazing. That's a, we get a few messages saying I had no idea um, like I didn't almost appreciate my country when I was living there or even if you're living here now um, I didn't you, you it's difficult to look at it through the eyes of a stranger but but us coming here and seeing how amazing it is here we love documenting and then you guys get excited when we're excited to be somewhere because maybe you haven't seen it in that light before but it's, yeah really cool nice coffee cup sleeves what a great idea cool Aww, they're so nice <laughs> They've got our names on wow. the top of I've got a camera. Wow, that's so cool. From Denise. So this is the lady, Denise and Owen, this is the lady who um, came to see us from Batangas who drove four or five hours to get here today, which is incredible. A really sweet note here as well. Uh, cert signed off certified juice. She's got that on her Instagram bio as well, which I love. Such a sweet, sweet message. It's a little cord keeper that we can put like that's like, handy. Or something. It says juicy on. So nice. So thoughtful. Wow, that's amazing. Just in here, I think I know what this one is because Mike got his out during the meetup. Did he? And it's <laughs> And it's so yeah, it is. It's so good. <laughs> Guys, look at this. 
How insane is that? Yes. So good. So it's, just, it's our photo making duty on the road Philippines. It's so good. Awesome. So thank you to Jeff. I think there's one for me in here as well. It's so good. And we've got mm. the second range of George's perfume. Lovely. <laughs> Look at that. So cool. I love it. I love the photo we picked as well. So suave, yeah. if I do say so myself. If you do say so yourself, Sir George. Thank you so much for watching this video. We hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Uh, subscribe if you want to get and turn the notification button on to be notified every time we upload. And go and like our Facebook page as well if you like. And follow us on Instagram. What else can I say? <laughs> um, thank you so much for watching. And again, a little shout out to anyone who came to our meetup today. It was so nice to meet all of you. And see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye.